lit up in just a couple of hours. Jack, that's right. It's part of Lights on Des Moines and the iCub Stadium here will be joining other Des Moines businesses and even homes that will dis be displaying red, white and blue lights and a symbol of thanks for all of the health care workers on the front lines fighting the coronavirus during this pandemic. And just hours earlier, nurses and other health care workers at Mercy One Des Moines stepped outside for a bit to see a parade in their honor. As well as Des Moines Day of Thanks, it's also Nurses Appreciation Day. We spoke with the woman who oversees 1600 nurses and additional support staff between the hospitals in Des Moines and West Des Moines, and she said she she gets emotional just thinking about the gratitude she has for her hardworking staff. I'm having goosebumps and tears just having you ask about it. It is, I'm so, so grateful for the community support, for the community recognition, for what our nurses and our healthcare team does certainly every day, but in particular during this COVID-19 pandemic. We're all very grateful for their work and they were even given hundreds of free meals. The nurses at Mercy One Des Moines today uh, to appreciate them and you can still take part in this effort for lights on Des Moines. You can go into your front yards and are even encouraged to wave flashlights around or if you want to be a spectator, uh, take the kids maybe out for a drive at 830 around the metro and you can see uh, all kinds of places lit up. It certainly will be a sight to see and a well deserved gesture of appreciation for all those workers. Live in Des Moines, Eva Anderson, Local 5 News, we are Iowa. Eva, thank you. If you want to show your thanks a little more, you can even download the DSM Day of Thanks signage by visiting the Greater Des Moines Partnerships website there at the bottom of your screen.